Glassmaking is yet another occupation with a long history in South Jersey. At Wheaton Arts, they still blow glass in the traditional way, but some of the tools are hard to come by. The molds and blocks used for shaping are made from churned wood, a specialty of woodworker Bob Brochart's. My father brought my older brother a lathe before World War II, and I've been playing with it ever since. When I was a kid, I didn't have store-bought wood. I used to go in the woods and cut a tree down and bring it home, put a piece on the lathe. And then from that, went to the natural edge bowl, and that's, that's what I prefer to do is the natural edge bowl with the natural bark still on it. He takes burls from trees, which is, he says are these big ugly things, and then he lets the particular grain of the wood shape the bowls that he makes. And they're, they're very beautiful. But he also found out that at Wheaton, the glass factory at Wheaton Arts, they needed someone to make the wood molds because very few people make those wooden molds for glass blowing anymore. The mold making is a dying industry. There's so little glass that works by hand to make wooden molds anymore. There's a mold maker that retired that I learned from in West Virginia and he's passed it on to a fellow up in New York State. But they're the only two in the East that I know of. The mold is used for production work where they can blow a piece in the glass, take it out and use the mold right away again. The block is a, is a hand piece that they use as they're working the glass. Soaking wet because the glass is roughly 2,000 degrees. So when he puts this wet wood to the glass, a thin layer of steam forms. The wood was put onto the glass, it would go right up in flame. So they keep them wet and it forms a layer of steam. And he works this on a handle just to form the glass as he's working. You need to be able to do good wood turning because the glass isn't gonna be smooth if the interior of the mold isn't smooth. And so he took his wood turning skills to start making the molds. I've done a lot of things, but I've always gone back to the woodworking, and uh, I really enjoy making a, the wood blocks for Wheaton.